Phil is in a dangerous spot here. Come on, machine, let's go. Baby, get out of there. And John Dutton is there and he asked Rip, he goes, he goes, Rip, he goes, he goes, what's the plan here? <laughs> and he goes. All right, if you watch, you can literally see him sinking. All right, back again. Uh, feels like day 16. Phil's on his way. I'm gonna try and get some Serious dirt moved. Two machines. I'm just trying to make the dam a little wider right now. Because the uh, excavator is a little more stable up, up here. today too because of that pop-up mini shower yesterday oh, oh there's Phil right there uh, hopefully we can make some stuff happen so Phil stopped the tractor he, he's coming to meet me and he's got to get on the pond dam and a part of the actual dam is slightly underwater but we just got a rain and it's pretty slick and he's not sure if he wants to go on it for fear of sliding in. So let's see. You come right here. Phil's a little nervous. He's going to slide down into the pond. Stone? Which it one? It keeps coming up on tick, TikTok. They're gonna move some cattle or whatever, and, and John Dutton is there, and he asked Rip. He goes, he goes, Rip. He goes, he goes. What's the plan here? He says, Well, what's the plan here? He says, Well, sir, the best me and the boys could come up with is. <laughs> and he goes, and so he gets on his horse. He goes, All right. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so here's the plan. If you missed the last episodes, you, you might want to start with them. Anyways, the pond dam blew out over here, um, up in front of me where I'm piling the dirt there. So I'm digging another borrow pit right here, as close as I can get. I'm going to move the dirt up onto the pond dam, or at least as close as I can. As you'll see, we're going to move a lot of dirt. And then Phil's going to start pushing it out there. Now the problem is, having to build this pond dam a foot or two higher than I anticipated is it's very narrow and I mean very narrow so you're gonna see several times Phil having pucker moments where his tires sink in off of the edge there and you'll see here at some different views it is steep in the back um, so that's what we're contending with today Hopefully he does not actually put it in the pond or roll it down the back of the pond dam, but that's what we're doing now. We're kind of, you know, repairing the blowout and having to bring this up a little bit higher than what I had originally planned. So let's see how we make out today. So also what we're doing as we're getting towards the blowout spot, we're making the dam wider for obvious reasons, you know, so we can get to the blowout spot and of course for more support for the, the high volume of water for the dam.
trying to find our footing here on the best way to move this dirt because this thing is so narrow. I mean, as you can see, we're widening it up here on top. So he's going to try pushing backwards with the blade while I pile fresh stuff and we'll see how that goes. Push went halfway decent.
dead in my tracks, literally. So throughout the day, you'll see I had to move farther and farther into the woods to get good dirt because um, we were close to the dam. So Phil has to like finagle his way in, back in on the, the narrow dam and then pick up the new dirt because I'm farther away now. I can't reach the dam anymore. <laughs> coming down in the hole and I'm slinging dirt over there. Oh gosh, really? I made my hole a little too deep right where I'm sitting. So I'm sitting cockeyed on it. So here you're going to see uh, Phil get puckered for the first time, uh, the first of many. He's got a really nice full bucket here, so let's kind of see how this goes. So he's trying to do a little back and forth action and he hits the soft stuff on the right side. So he starts kind of sinking in towards the pond dam, towards the actual pond, tries to get himself out a little bit, but let's see how it goes. Phil is in a dangerous spot here. Come on machine, let's go. Halfway falling into the pond. I want to get a little better position. Oh!
part, if you watch, you can literally see him sinking uh, real time here. That would have been bad. And that's how close it was. Went here, now we got them out. <clears throat> I'm gonna pull that inside back in and uh, just pack it a little bit just in case he accidentally does that again. You know, you miss by an inch on a forward or backward track, at least with the tractor. And that's what happens. All right, well, if you're still here to the end, thank you very much for joining us on this next episode. Stay tuned for the next couple. We're doing this in chronological order, basically, as it happens. And you guys get to share it with us. Believe me, on this day, which was a long day, he got stuck several times. I don't remember how many times we had to pull him out. And at the end of it, well, I guess I won't, won't give, it up, give up the ghost. But anyways, if you enjoy our content, please hit the like button. We greatly appreciate it and consider sharing it for us to help us get out there a little bit more because uh, we keep it real here and we are always pushing for new life adventures and land management projects. So I hope to see you again on the next episode. Thanks a lot.